the next couple of weeks, we're going to put the spotlight on the startup incubators and co-working spaces with the aim to understand different models that presently exist in the market. So on the show today, we put the spotlight on Nexus, a New Delhi-based incubator program at the American Center and three of the startups that have graduated from it. Roadbound, it's a Pune-based startup that detects road conditions using just a smartphone. Morfido, an online 3D printing service platform for rapid prototyping and customized manufacturing. And Escrofer, which offers consumers an escrow account for real estate transactions. Founded in 2017, Nexus is run in collaboration with the University of Texas Austin and serves as a business incubator for startups. Take a look. Our mandate here, in part, at least in public diplomacy, is to provide opportunities for Indians and Americans to share best practices. Three years ago, that there was a tremendous need for quality, effective incubators. Um, and the U.S. government's perspective is that um, not only are we advancing entrepreneurs, small and medium enterprises here in, in India, but we're also providing opportunities for American companies to partner with Indian startups um, to um, use Indian startups and Indian, so several of these Nexus alumni have become suppliers for American companies doing business here. So it's good for um, the bilateral economic relationship. Technology incubator, we're a business incubator. And it's anything the startup needs from A to Z to get them up and being sustainable. So what we do is we have a 10-week pre-incubation program, which is a very intense physical program here at Nexus. And the topics we cover would range everything from marketing, from value proposition, to intellectual property, to doing your finances. Uh, funding, how to pitch for funding, everything, and also market validation, going and talking to your customers. So in this 10 weeks, uh, we try to cover the basics of what you need as a startup to make sure that you're investable ready, or that you're sustainable on your own sense. Now we do look at early stage startups, but they do have to be past the ideation stage. So usually we look at startups that have a prototype, um, either a lab prototype or an industrial prototype. They may have customers, or they're just about to have a customer, but before industrial or investment funding. So if they've already gotten VC type funding, venture capital funding, at that point they're probably too late for us. But we do want something after the prototype, uh, right around revenue, uh, but before institutional funding. So what does the Indian Air Force, Nestle and HPCL have in common? Well, they all use the services of Delhi-based startup Morfido for rapid prototyping and 3D printing of customized parts and packaging. Founded in 2015 by Manya Jha and Sushil Baranwal, while in their second year of college, Morfido has created a steep growth curve as a services and design consultancy platform. Recognized by DIPP Startup India program, Morfido is pushing the Make in India agenda. Here's their story. We started when we were, uh, two, we are two founders and we started when we were in college. Morfido is a 3D printing services company for businesses to access manufacturing of prototypes and custom parts on demand. Uh, we very closely work with uh, R&D departments and product development departments of uh, companies ranging from startups to Fortune 500 companies. And uh, we help them go to market fast, we reduce their uh, uh, lead time and uh, yeah, that's, we do small batch production for them, that's what we do. We uh, do not have uh, a complete in-house facility. What we do is we utilize nationwide network of 3D printing facilities to fulfill the orders. We uh, handhold our customers, we get in customers, we handhold them through the consultancy, through the designing processes and then uh, we, when the orders are converted, we direct them uh, to uh, qualified vendors across India. We have served uh, 200 plus customers and we have completed over 1000 plus new product development projects and uh, to name a few of our customers we have served Indian Air Force, uh, we are right now working with uh, Indian Navy in collaboration with IIT Delhi, uh, we have, uh, we, uh, Nestle is our ongoing uh, client, we are, uh, we are registered vendors of companies like uh, Mahindra Defense, Rekord Ben Kaiser, to name a few. So when we work with these uh, companies, we generally work with their R&D departments or new product development uh, 
teams. So, uh, say for example, if we talk about Indian Air Force, uh, we help them develop a working prototype of their missile, uh, which they use for their training purposes. Uh, but for companies like Nestle, we uh, we are their registered uh, vendors for uh, their R&D partners of their packaging department. So, what we do there is uh, we uh, start. Sometimes we start right from the concept of their hard packaging development. We do their prototype and we also do their small batch productions which goes in the uh, testing. The industrial grade 3D printing vendors that we have, uh, we have uh, 10 plus across India. So uh, three of them are in Delhi, we have them in Bangalore and we have them in Nasik as well. So uh, there's this government cluster, uh, Nasik engineering cluster which also uh, does some of our work. And uh, uh, if you talk about the vendors that hold desktop uh, 3D printers or the small 3D printers, we have uh, say 15 plus of them. Well, here's wishing Mania the very best of luck and welcome to the Young Turks community.